Alright, so, as you can see, things have changed, but in the last episode, we took on a couple of side quests, got Armin Sword back, and took on a bandits. Oh boy, that was fun. But tonight, uh, in between, I mean, I went ahead and upgraded my gear, upgraded stuff, even got a backpack with a bedroll. And now we're gonna hit High Rothgars. We need to get the Iverstead first. Let me actually mark it. There we go. Now there's three ways I can do this. Walk all the way from White Run, all the way north from the mountains through here, come up. And I believe it's down and around. Which is the long route. I can go south, go through Helgen. There's a path through here that will take me... It's a shorter distance, but I remember there was actually like a vampire cave in between here. Somewhere around there. Which can be bad. But the third one, which <laughs> might actually be reasonable, is take a carriage from Whiterun to Riften and just from Riften follow the river to Iverstead. But if I remember, there's a. There's some bandits in between Riften and Iverstead. I'm gonna take the short route and see how that goes. That's my that's my decision. Short route first. Through Helgen. One way or another, I'm ending this episode. At the very least, in Iverstead. <laughs> if not High Rothgar. It depends on how annoyed I get at the end of it. I'm trying to save time, I'm also trying to save money and resources that I just don't already don't have. <laughs> oh yeah, another thing about the modded house I spoke about last session. Or you know, last uh, episode. There I can buy it for ten thousand gold instead of using the key, if y'all rather I do that. <sighs> instead of just boom house. <laughs> Oh, that's always a good sight. I'm not even... If you're gonna fight, fight! Yep, there he goes. Okay. Yeah, that's gonna be a problem later, I can already tell. But yeah, let's go... Hello. Hello, mud crab. What you doing over here? heal myself. Because <laughs> I hurt a lot. Right, I need to eat. Oh, also, I have a 
the mod that expands White Run that I explained in the first episode, it also adds a bakery, which also has food I can eat. So that's nice. I don't want to... There we go. That way it's just not bothering me for the moment. We have plans go th go through Riverwood, back to Helgen. Go through Helgen. And then go from there. And down the line, I'll do the Helgen Reborn mod, which added its own quest line. I heard wolves, but I'm glad I didn't attack, because I would not be able to defend myself. I mean, I can, I just don't want to. I'm trying to save resources. Wait, so a costume? You're not serious. <laughs> sure I am. My son's been asked to join the war. Not this again. If he does, tell him how bad the food is and how dangerous. <laughs> Jesus. I'm pretty sure I have to still have the Thief Stone active. I never hit this mine, excuse me. Shit. I meant to do it earlier, y'all, you know, during the redoing everything. I meant to hit it. I'm not gonna hit it now. Maybe in between. What happened? Oh wait, this is stuff I dropped. Never mind. <laughs> that stuff I dropped at the beginning when I was over encumbered. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I saw the. Thief stone active. Let me double check. Yep. So I don't need to look at them again. <gasps> I like how the only thing I'm worried about on this path is the vampire cave because that's really the only thing I am worried about. If I take a long route, there'd be more stuff trying to kill me. See, this is pretty tame compared to what I come across in my other uh, character. That's also on survival mode, but on an easier difficulty because I don't like dish. I don't want stress when I'm just trying to be casual. <laughs> I'm 
All right, let's go through hell again. Which may or may not have bandits by this point. Yeah, it looks like I just bandits now. This might be a fight. I don't understand that, but whatever. <laughs> that was just a bad shot. Some of these are just legitimate bad shots. Because I'm terrible at aiming. I don't even bother with it. I'm just gonna keep moving. But yeah, I need to go this way. Yeah, Iris dead. Saving a minute here. Just because I don't know what else could be up here. Besides this guy. strong cloaks, so you're fine. Right? Yeah, you're strong cloaks. Alright. Nothing to worry about right now. <laughs> oh yeah, it's starting to get cold, so it's gone. I'm sort of starting to lose my maximum health, and I'm starting to slow down. Just because it's freezing up here. I think it's around here I should quick save. Think. Yeah. Just in case. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Good day. This game has vampires in it, if I remember. 
I don't think I want to deal with it. Last time I came through here, there was a character, there was one waiting outside. So, yeah, I don't need to. There's also that thing. God, another one. Beat the shit out of it. Where am I going? <laughs> South. Alright. It's easy to lose yourself. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I just this way. Sheesh. Please warm up soon. Because I know High Rothgar is going to be freezing. Nope, those goats are dead. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I don't know why that scared me so much. because it's kind of important later. For an entirely different mod. But hey, I'm getting warm. Which is good. Ah, <sighs> warm but it's chilly. You know what? It's better than freezing. That's a spoder. My God, is that a fucking bear as well? <laughs> and I'm here. Let's just get through here as fast as possible. Oh, no, 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 no one's out here. It's like 5 in the morning. I'm going to explain it. Yeah, we're going to keep going and just boosh, see what happens. Found more, which I am not interested in fighting right now. Not these conditions.
Let's kill these wolves. Because I know you're gonna be threatened if I don't. Where's my hood? Oh, I guess the visual helmet. Oh, yeah, that's the thing Khajiits do when they get into a fight. Ears go back, eyes narrow, fangs bared. <laughs> it's very nice detail. Just in case there was another sneak attack on me, I'm quick saving. What the fuck? Oh. Oh! Just fucking go. Don't even bother trying. He's right on my ass. <laughs> uh, I don't really have anything else. This is dumb. It bought me some time. There it is. It's right there. Summoned the dragon board to hide Rokka. Such a thing has not happened to me. Can I wait for Lydia? Lydia? Tell me you're not dead. I can't tell if my follower is dead. That's, a, that's my problem right now. Or if she's broken. She's probably broken. I'm going in here. <laughs> Welcome to the Villamere. Okay. If there's anything I can get you, just let me know. If I were you, I'd keep away from the barrow on the east side of town. Drink for the thirsty, food for the hungry. Give me your pie. Give me your goat roast. Sure thing. It's yours for it. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Hello, Lydia. If you're I'm glad you're alive. Monastery, watch your step. It's a long way down. Let me know if there's anything else you need. We don't get many visitors through here. Unless they're headed up to High Hrothgar, of course. Good for you. Can I pick anything off of you? Was that a... Yes, it is. Never. <laughs> eh, he's gone. Eh, whatever.
But hey, I made it into Iverstead in less than half an hour. Hunger. Now I'm gonna go talk to the Greybeards. Food. That's what I'm looking for. Pardon me, my lord. Would you care to hear me play my lute? You... Jesus. <laughs> Damn bear. You never settle down to have children. Think twice before you do it. What is happening for my game right now? Oh, you're a traveler. You must have so much to tell. On your way up the 7,000 steps again, Clement? <laughs> Not today. I'm just not ready to make the climb to High Hrothgar. The path isn't safe. Aren't the Greybeards expecting some supplies? Honestly, I'm not certain. I've yet to be allowed into the monastery. Perhaps one day. Passing through on your way to High Hrothgar? About to make a delivery up there myself. What type of delivery, sir? Mostly food supplies like dried fish and salted meats. You know, things that keep fresh for a long time. The Greybeards tend not to get out much, if you catch my meaning. Well, it's kind of an understanding between us. I mean, it just wouldn't feel right to charge them for a bit of preserved food. Trouble is, my legs aren't what they used to be, and climbing the 7,000 steps takes its toll. Sure. Yeah, I really? can do it. Really? Well, that would be kind of you. Here, take this bag of supplies. At the top of the steps, you'll see the offering chest. Just leave the bag inside, and you're done. All right. Be careful up there. The fun part is going to be getting to the top, and then coming back down. And then later, going back up. It's a process. There's already a threat. How dare you, sir. Uh, let's use my steel arrows. <laughs> Lydia, you were right behind me. Where Watch it. You ever settle down to have children? Think twice before you do it. This is already a pain. Oh, you're a traveler. You must have so much to tell about the world. On your way up the seven thousand steps again. Passing through, mostly. For the Give me your. Beards tend not to get out. Well, the trouble is, <gasps> my legs are real. Here, take this back. Not today. I'm just not ready. To Quick save this time. Why? This is this is ridiculous.
This is going to be a long climb. <sighs> Alright. Let's try not attracting the bears. They're gonna come this way anyway, so get the cross bridge. Get to town to help. <laughs> I think I'm gonna disable this mod for this playthrough. Cause it's just making it so much un it's making it unnecessarily more challenging. supposed to do? Oh. Lydia, don't. Don't do it, Lydia. I'm just gonna quick load that. Turn around and run this way. I'll get to be allowed into the monastery. Perhaps one day. And it moved. Lydia, where'd you go? There you are. Still here. I will remain on guard here. Yes, you better stay fucking here too. I'm trying to lure them over here. And just have the town fight them. That's the goal, anyway.
Jeez. Well, that's one threat taken care of. I gotta worry about the other threat that's coming up. But I'm not sure which one's worse. I think the bears are worse, because at least the spider Lydia can tank easy. The spider can one shot me if I'm not careful. jump button. Alright, oh, she's still standing guard. Forgot to change that. <laughs> uh. Ow. Almost hit me. There we go. We heading out? As you will, my thing. I will protect you with my life. You better. I'm sorry. You're nice. I said be nice. <laughs> Anything, we just worry about getting to the top. Quick save as often as I need to. That's a goat. Yeah, I think I'm, I think after this episode, I'm gonna tone down the immersive creatures, or at least dis it, probably gonna disable it entirely. Cause it's uh, it's really making things worse. Let's see if I can't nab anything from you, sir. Not really. Oh, now I can. Get my pickpocket skill up. There we go. You know, kind of expected here, to be fair. Especially at my level. I didn't expect it to be that strong. Then again, I didn't heal myself after the spider. So... Yeah. Let me do that. And then let's drink some resist frost potions. Do I have any? Have I used them all? It looks like I've used them all. <laughs> Shit. Alright. Oh, maybe do. What I got. What I got is absolutely nothing. Oops. 
sorry, Lydia. I should not be getting that close up. That's the damage it can deal to me. God damn it. I just tell myself. Ooh. Ice rates are hard for me to hit. Because <laughs> I'm not sure where I'm supposed to be aiming. It just fell and died. I'm gonna fall and die too if I don't get off this goddamn ledge. It's in a spot where I can't even loot it. So that sucks. But you know what? That's a victory. <laughs> oh yeah, it's gonna get real cold up here. Uh, do I have any? I really need to invest in warm clothing next time. And I hear wolves. You know what? I'd rather deal with wolves at this point. Remember I said I would rather deal with wolves? I lied. Help. And you're stuck. I'm like doing no weapon or no damage or anything else. Just use the bow. Just stick to archery. Should be nice right now. I don't know why I didn't invest in one. Can I light these things? They're just. Oh. No, because these are offerings. Not, you know, stuff that can burn. That sucks. Oh, quick save, right as I'm freezing. Whew, boy. 
You would think as a Khajiit, you'd be more resistant to colder weathers. Because of their fur. And Argodians might be, you know... <laughs> they freeze faster. And a Nord might be okay. I don't know. I'll play as a Nord on my own time. See what happens. Quick save. If you have a dagger, I'm gonna steal it. Keep an eye out for wolves if you're headed up the path to High Yep, alright. Wolves aren't my worry right now. Uh, can I warm myself with my own fire? No. That would have been nice. It's more of what's around this corner I'm worried about. Yeah, there he is. Nice, Lydia. I have, like, nothing that can help me in this. Like, I wish, like, ale and stuff like that would actually help warm. I guess I don't, I guess it doesn't really do that. I don't know if eating and resist frost will actually help me. Probably not. I'm just gonna go. He's right on my ass, isn't he? <laughs> I just, I have to go. I am freezing to death. So unprepared for this. I don't want Lydia to die, but she might have to just so I can, you know, get there.
Oh, man. I don't know if you can actually die of... free from freezing, but... Oh, but he is alive! What are the effects of freezing? Health is reduced. 30% slower. Lockpicking and <laughs> pickpocketing is 70% harder. I wonder why I had 0% chance to steal from that person earlier. Oh, it's right there. Let me drop off Clipix packages and get inside. Ooh. I made it inside. I need a fire. It's warm in here, so it's fine. So, a dragonborn appears at this moment in the turning of the age. Well, oh. Let us see if you truly are dragonborn. Let us taste of your voice. There we go. Dragonborn, it is you. Welcome to High Hrothgar. I am Master Angir. I speak for the Greybeards. Do you? Now, tell me, Dragonborn. Why have you come here? To destroy my enemies. I just want to find out, we Dragonborn. We are here to guide you in that pursuit. Just as the Greybeards have sought to guide those of the dragon blood that came before you. You are not the first. There have been many of the dragon blood since Akatosh first bestowed that gift upon mortal kind. Whether you are the only dragonborn of this age, that is not ours to know. You are the only one that has been revealed thus far. Because dragons that are only in Skyrim. Said. Um, let's you learn. shown that you are dragonborn. <gasps> you have the inborn gift. But, do you have the discipline and temperament to follow the path laid out for you? Uh, that remains to be seen. Oh, you better find out. Without what bitch. Training, you have already taken the first steps towards projecting your voice into a thum, a shout. Now, let us see if you are willing and able. When you shout, you speak in the language of dragons. Yeah, yeah. Thus, your dragon blood gives you oh, the oh, oh. ability to learn words of power. All shouts are made up of three words of power. As you master each word, your shout will become progressively stronger. Master Einarf will now teach you Roll. And I'm starting to get hungry, of course. In unrelenting force. Roll means balance in the dragon tongue. Combine it with fus, force, to focus your thumb more sharply. Give it to me. Stare at it long enough, it'll get into me eventually. There we go. Learning a word of power is only the first step. You must unlock its meaning through constant practice in order to use it in a shout. Well, that is how the rest of us learn shouts. As Dragonborn, you can absorb a slain dragon's life force and knowledge directly. As part of your initiation, Master Einard will allow you to tap into his understanding of hope. It's probably like the most tedious part of a uh, the main storyline. Just learning all of this because you're not actually doing anything; it's just being given to you, and you just force to take it if you want to, you know, get stronger and progress. 
How stupid I fucking look. Well done. Again. You learn quickly. Once more. Impressive. Your thumb is precise. You show great promise, Dragonborn. Yep. We will perform your next trial in the courtyard. Follow Master Bori. Yeah, this is yeah, this is just tedious. It's just here, do this. Listen, watch. And it's like you're just learning to be Dragonborn. I don't know, it's just me. The air is frigid here. All right, I'm gonna wait. Because <laughs> I never would have been in place. What? Master Bori will teach you. Why? I should equip it. Chili, drain, and peckers. Yay! <laughs> Mr. Wolfgar will demonstrate whirlwind sprint. Then it will be your turn. Master Bori? Rex! Wolf! Now it's your turn. Stand next to me. Master Bori will open the gate. Use your whirlwind sprint to pass through before it closes. Yeah, I know. I already know all this. Good. Your quick mastery of a new thume is uh, astonishing. I'd heard the stories of the abilities of Dragonborn, but to see it for myself. You were given this gift by the gods for a reason. It is up to you to determine how best to use it. You are now ready for your last trial. Am I though? The horn of Jorgen Windcaller, our founder, from his tomb in the ancient fane of Ostengrad. Remain true to the way of the voice, and you will return. All right. I am out. You're fucking inside. And warm up. It's good God. I have no idea where the beds are. Or if I'm allowed to sleep in one of them. I didn't need one. Soon. Especially if I want to level up. I don't think I can... I can, though. Now, what does this even do? Comfortable? I just come through warm. Okay. <laughs> but at any rate, 
Let's get to the bottom of the mountain. Oh boy. Yeah, now to make the descent back down the mountain. I need food, that's right. I had forgotten why I opened up my inventory for a moment. This is gonna be stupid. If the troll will stall out here and he's pissed. I would be. Someone came up my mountain and started beating the shit out of me. <laughs> I'd be pissed. Curious. What side of the mountain am I on? Okay. Towards Helgen. I could just descend the mountain from here, I guess. A quick save before, just in case, you know, it decides to be certain death. Which it might be just from the looks of it. But you never know. It is actually working. I'm gonna end up in Helgen. That's alright. Nope, this is Riverwood, actually. Yeah, this is Riverwood. <sighs> Just gotta be super careful. safety. Okay. I'll just ignore that. New to Riverwood? If you're looking for work, go see how that will be. You there. You're the one they call Dragonborn. Yes, I am Dragonborn. Your lies fall on deaf ears, Deceiver. <gasps> the true Dragonborn comes. You are but his shadow. When Lord oh, you Merrick caught appears, quick. all shall bear witness. None shall stand to oppose him. Well, guess what? <laughs> that hurt a lot more than it should. Where's my... Let me just eat a bunch of cheese here. Get out of the line of fire. Try out their skirts. That guard almost hit me.
they are way too crowded in there for me to do anything. You put your weapons away, damn. Oh, my weapons weren't away. I was gonna pull them out the fixer, but I just didn't put mine away. And this is as good as Soul's time. Mmm, sugar. Okay. Um. Alright, let me disable this quest shit. Dragonborn, because that's a, that's a DLC that I am not going to do anytime soon. Alright, so. Oh boy. That was an adventure. I'm gonna take it back to Iristed so I can do that. To, so I can do the side quest of the barrows there. Oh well. At any rate, uh. That's a good stopping place for me. I'm gonna drop my character. Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. Get him a room. I'm the innkeeper. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. That way you can sleep it off. Just to sleep a good 12 hours. Because <laughs> I leveled up. Let's put it in the health. And then more sneak. That's good, once that's good. Is the hunger gonna proc? It's usually what happens. Oh, get my way. Oh, I hate when followers stay in the fucking doorway. It's so annoying. But, uh... Yeah, that's a good place. And next episode, we can go... I can go back to Iverstead, do that. Or... No, he doesn't want to do... Oh, there it is. <laughs> Going to go back to... White Run, go through there, go to... I think I'm just going to take the carriage to Morthal and just go north to get to the Ustin Grav. Instead of trying to walk all the way around. Then again, I am going to disable the uh, immersive creature spot, so it might be a fun adventure to walk around. I'll figure out in between then and now. But at any rate, that'll be for the next that'll be for this one. Uh, I haven't been saying this for like the past five, six episodes, but uh, if you enjoyed this, like, leave a comment, subscribe, maybe. I don't know, you know, you'll get more of this bullshit. But anyway, see you next time.